Salam people on a good evening, this is Na Ibrahim. Um, uh, just want to pass on a very, very important information. I uh, share an audio from uh, Mr. Wahid Bangura uh, this morning. We uh, is a civil engineer based out in New Jersey. And, uh, you know, uh, a dyad NGC KKY supporter because, you know, like I say, uh, people that we mean well for we country to definitely, you know, they, they really they go far, far and, you know, beyond and above, you know, doing the best they could for provide very pertinent information to them. So I just decided to do this audio real quick. So I could just buttress the points that we mentioned, you know, in uh, um, audio day. So, um, first of all, I begin with the fact that we all know say Salon, it's, uh, the population is about 7 million. So, 7 million people in a Salon. But of the 7 million people in a Salon, uh, we have a registered uh, number of about 3.1 million that they are registered for vote so far, that the number that they will get. About 3.1 million. Maybe that might change. But for right now, it's 3.1 million people them, that are registered for vote for this upcoming elections, 2018. So of that 3.1 million, they will make about, you know, it's about 44.9% of the population of Sierra Leone, you know. So inside that 44.9% day of the population of Sierra Leone, we need about 55.5%, you know, for able for win the elections. So again, you know, this is for NGC members. I know say, uh, you know, Mr. Wahid Bangura, you know, not for mention saying I'm a brother-in-law. But, you know, we only work very hard for make sure, say, yes, we do all we could, the small way we could, that we really corner the information, say, you know, we push the agenda. Because uh, we all know, say, Dr. Imkela for sure, not the one for Salon. So I just want to set we eye on, um, you know, on the target, low, get focused, you know, low, no, miss the timing, because the term no longer. You know, we all know, say, we're not get better term again. So that make it go over the numbers there. You know, and um, the reason why they go over the numbers here, just like uh, Mr. Bangura says, is the fact that, uh, you know, we want no way to with the target. You know, we don't want to shoot blind planks. You know, we want to make sure, say, we shoot straight and we shoot accurately. So we have 16 districts in uh, the uh, old country, 16 districts. And inside in 16 districts here, yeah, we, we have about 132 constituencies there. You know, we don't say the constituencies them that they will get members of parliament there. And inside uh, there we have also about 446 wards. Mm -hmm. And the wards them that they will get council members, mayors, etc., etc. You know. So again, we have 16 districts. We have 132 constituencies. And we have 446 wards, you know, where they elect council members and, you know, mayors. So, and also, very important, we get 3,300 polling stations them all over the country. So my question is, and I know we're working on that on the ground, you know, uh, Dr. Dennis Bright would attest to this. And Dr. Imkela, of course, you said they listen to this. So inside our 3,000 polling stations, we want to make sure that we are represented in each one of them. We, let's say, minimum two agents per polling station. We need about 6,600 people, you know, for Didi. Because we have to be present. Because we want to make sure, say, inside we'll get support staff them back. People that will get for the for count the, 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 the votes them, you know. Because we, we, we want for it, we want for make sure, say, yes, everything is free and fair, you know. So um, we 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 also get like a, a two new districts they already know had in the um, northern part, the Falaba and Karen area, a two new districts, and Falaba get about sixty five thousand people as far as the population there, and then in a four constituencies the inside it. So are we represented in those areas, NGC? That is the question for we all. And um, Karen get 101,000 people in the population, and we get five constituencies. Okay, so uh, I just want to point them here out, like how Mr. Bangura mentioned. So let we all see them, because that is the goal. Let we know blindsided with all the distractions we get from all these other people, and we, you know, in the SLPP camp or APC camp with all the distractions. We get a lot of people, and we know even mean well for a country. We know, but the people of Sierra Leone realize and see this time around. Dr. Yimkela, 91 for be the president. But we get for be very strategic and we move for we'll make sure say, we achieve the objective day. That is the goal. Okay? So, um, you know, we're looking at logistics, you know, we get for, we also get for the raise funds then uh, for like, for good to set the groundwork and this and that. But these are very important information then, you know, where I want for share with everybody, you know. So, um, of course, we know say December 1st, then they dissolve all the councillors then. All councillors are going to be dissolved December 1st. So it's NGC. Are we, we don't get people and we will get for strategically put in place, you know, for represent winning elections in the 
those are some of the things we'll get for a look at. Parliament, you know, uh, between uh, uh, March 7th, between uh, 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 Parliament will be dissolved on the 7th of March, mm -hmm. when our election day. But from January 3rd to uh, February 14th, you know, we'll get for beginning nomination uh, for councillors there. So those are things we want to take into consideration, we want to look at. When I make a pass on this information, because it's very critical, we we'll get for plan. We we'll get people, them, young man, them, want to team up, want to go and take them position there. Because at the end of the day, being a president, if you know, get you people in a parliament for, for support you drive and, you know, push your aspirations and goal, you know, it can be very difficult. So not just the presidency, we're not just looking at the presidency, but we want to make sure, say, we, we, we cover all the area in day. You know, so that's why we, you know, Mr. Barua and myself, we mentioned this and we make it clear, let we know, say, yes, at least we have a target, you know. So um, now I'm just going to look at the districts, them, you know, uh, the constituencies within this district, them. So like Kailaun, get 10 constituencies inside Kailaun area. So we need, we need 10 people where we represent NGC in that all in constituency they need for Team Apde, you know. Mm -hmm. Kenema get 11. So Kono get 9. I want to take notes. If you don't listen to this, I want to take notes. If you need to reverse the video, reverse them, take notes. But these are the districts them. I want to pay attention to that specifically. You know, they want to get somebody with a team up on behalf of NGC for representing the area in the Bombali, Koinadugu, get six constituencies. Tonkolili gets maybe eight, but now they don't add two. So now ten constituencies did not uh, Tonkolili. Are we represented? It's NGC represented. We get people that want to stand by now. We don't ready for team up at them place they are. You know, Kambi, I get six mm. uh, constituencies there. Pujaung get six. Bonth get three. Of course, me, but man, I bonth then come out. So, I don't know how to get it. Moyamba get six. You know, Bo, it kind of confusing. Bo, we get for pay special attention at Bo with the numbers and let people and get for no side and get for good votes, like confusion all day. You know, and uh, so uh, the western area, the rural part, we get eight constituency day. In the western area, urban, we get about 20 constituencies. Are we represented? This is the question what they throw to NGC. So, uh, Dr. Dennis Bright, you know, all the bright, beautiful people working downtown, you know, I know say yes, and as much as we are focused on bringing Dr. Yumkela into power because we know say it will change with people in life with all in developmental strides and aims and aspirations, all in know how early experience we don't gain over these years, you know, we, we see we get it gets a lot of unfinished projects there. Where we know say if he become the president, obviously go finish them. You know, like the Bankasoka project, we all see that the way the giddy people really likes now they like a tea that side. You know, so this election it boils down to about substance and character. So I know I waste my time discuss other people them where we know say no even necessary at this point we want for focus, focus and get a you know a, a pinpoint accurate you know trajectory towards how we get for achieve this objective of you know winning this election, let we go better with people in life, you know. Um, so that the only message I get for past you now, have a good night, okay? All right, love one all, bye bye. Again, Ibrahim, you know, if you mean well for Salon, pass this message, share them, we'll discuss them. NGC, this is for you guys, love Sierra Leone, okay? Development is coming, blessings are coming. Salon, a blessed country, Salon, wonderful, Salon, a great country. We get wonderful, beautiful people. By God in power, Dr. Ibrahim, go free una, yeah, from the bondage of all them wicked, wicked politicians there, and the one that we sympathize with them. All right. Love and all. Bye-bye.